Hello my dear viewers, watch up, welcome to my channel. It's me, Vilya Sadulio, a teacher in profession of Fashion Studio Video Tutorial. Today I will be teaching you how to make a business card using Microsoft Publisher 2016. The goodness of Microsoft Publisher is you all already given a template so I just open it here and then just click business card and then there are different uh, templates that you can select so it's up to you which one do you think is is fit or good for you so I will be selecting this one I like this design you can change the design color Click and then click create. So I, I just choose this one because of the girly color, but you can uh, change the the style by just clicking it here. You can read it wood, shamrock, and there are different uh, designs uh, that you can choose from. I just like that. I will be selecting summer because I have the purple color. I like the purple color. And then here you can have the business name, the name, your name, of course, and the organization, the primary address, and phone number, fax, and email address. So it's as simple as that. So first is to write your business name. So if you do not want this one, the style of the font, you can just go to home and change the style of the font and then you can increase the size and you can just move it later after or I will change the color into blue because I do not want red color in my business card I will be selecting much darker blue color this one so I just click more colors and then click OK then I can type now so I will be as an example by the way and then I want to increase the size of this so I will just highlight this one and then click this one until it fits that box in there or you can have you can have the insert the uh, word art if you want to have some design okay, let us see so we'll use insert word art so we'll select the design that is good for this one so let us make it capitalize So there are two options. Okay, so it's so much bigger. So we can just adjust this one. So just click it here and then let us adjust. Will not fit if you will not adjust. Oops, that's enough. Okay, there. or it will fit in the box. Okay, you can also make that red in that one. There are shapes that you can uh, choose from. I like that one. Okay, maybe I'll just choose that purple color again. Okay, then let us proceed to the name. The one, this one. They write your name. They're using my name here. And then title. 
can also make this as one so that there is no more additional boxes in here. Just uh, click insert and then you just select another font style and you write here your designation. Okay, you can lower this if you want, or you can make this also larger in size. It's up to you also if you want to change the color. Okay, then if you are done, you can proceed to this one. Here you can put the logo of your organization. So just click insert. And then go to picture, then identify the logo. So I have already here the, my logo name. Okay, so you also are uh, trying to readjust this one so that it will fit to the desired shape of the box. So just click it there. Okay, there you have it. You can make some, uh, what's this? You can make some borders in here if you want. Just right click and uh, format picture. You can click color lines. You can have here the line color. You can have blue, for example, and then you can increase the width if you want to make it bigger. So let us remain that too. It's too much big enough. Oh my gee. And then the, the style can have flat, round, square. And then you can even add border art if you want. If you want to have some border art, you can just click it here and then it will show you different styles of borders. So it's up to you to choose which one. Okay. Let's see what will be the result. Oh, that's it. So it's so bigger in size. We can just adjust this one. Again, go back to picture color and lines. So in the border art, you can decrease the size. So there is, you can see if you can, this one, this one here. Let's make it full. So the smaller I think okay let's click okay and there you have it you already have the design or you can change whatever you want the background or the borders then after that you can just change here the business business address You can just readjust this one in your desired in your desired uh, length or width. Okay, we'll be typing. You can also change the font style. Then if you are done, you can increase the size if you want. Just highlight, then click here. Then you can proceed to the phone number. So, okay, let us have that one. Okay. 
Okay, then let's say that's my fax number. Oh my G. Box number okay, that's it. Can also readjust this one. You can also increase the size if you want to. Okay, now we are done. So what you need to do is just, of course, you have to save your file, click Save As, and then Browse. And then it's up to you where you want to save your file. So I will be saving this in my document. This is business card, my business card. And then it's save and then if you want to print that immediately you can just have a file print and there you have it so in a uh, one whole absurd many paper there are uh, one two three four five or ten number of copies that you can make so that is guys it's now ready for printing if you are connected to your printer just click it okay or print then you have your business card thank you guys for watching i hope i help you in making business card uh, do not forget to subscribe at the bottom of this video and if you like it do not hesitate to I'll click the like button and please I look forward for my other videos in the future. Good day everyone. See you on my next video.